Zuko here, and it is time for my June TBR, and it is Pride Month. So I would like to read books with queer characters, hopefully main characters, uh, and uh, yeah, let's let's see what books I have to choose from. Essentially, this is all of the books that I own that I haven't read yet that are about queer people. I believe they have queer main characters, all of them. I could be wrong about some, I'm just going with like what I've seen on Goodreads for like where people tag things, so I honestly don't know if a couple of these have queer people, but these are just my options for what to read. If I read one of these books, I'll be happy. If I read all of these books, I'll be super happy because that's a pretty decent sized dent in a month for me. <laughs> so first I have A Fire and Stars by Audrey Cultthirst. This is a fantasy novel about a princess who is betrothed to some prince in another kingdom where magic is forbidden, which kind of sucks because she has fire magic, but she ends up falling for the prince's sister. Um, so it's like lesbian princesses. That's all I need. That's all I need to know. Next I have Dreadnought by April Daniels. This is about a trans girl who uh, isn't out yet, I don't think, and um, she ends up watching this like world famous superhero die and she inherits his powers which in turn gives her the body that she wants. Uh, so she has to try to deal with this new thing and also being a superhero. And I believe this is own voices so it is written by a trans author but I could be wrong, correct me on that. Um, but yeah, this sounds super cool. I love superheroes. Next I have Buffering, Unshared Tales of a Life Fully Loaded by Hannah Hart. I love Hannah Hart and I haven't read this yet, so I would love to read this this month. I would have had Binge by Tyler Oakley on here because I own the book, but I've already read the book, so I kind of don't need to reread it. So in the Goodreads tag, I said the next book I wanted to buy was Every Heart a Doorway by Shauna McGuire, and that's exactly what I did. I really want to read this this month. It's super short and I believe the main character, or it has an asexual character, Possibly the main character. That's all I need to know. I never get to read about ace people and that's all I want to read about. So I'm super excited about this. Then, like last month, I want to read Simon and the Homo Sapiens Agenda because I didn't do that last month. This is about a kid who is not out at a school and somewhere and finds out that he's gay, I think, or something and blackmails him and he has a relationship or something with someone online named Blue and we find out who that is or something. I could be super wrong. But uh, yeah, I'm interested in reading this this month because I didn't do it last month. And just like the last book, I have uh, History is All That You Left Me, which I had on my TBR last month that I did not read, by uh, Adam Silvera. This is about a kid whose ex-boyfriend dies, and he bonds with his ex-boyfriend's, like, current boyfriend, but not so current because he's dead. Um, and I think it might be a romance between those two, but I don't know for sure. Next, I have two books that I'm not actually sure if they are, like, full of queer people or not, but I think they are, and that would be Carry On by Rainbow Rowell, which is, like, kind of a Harry Potter-esque book. That's all I know about it. I think someone in here is gay. I don't know who. Don't spoil it. I mean, maybe spoil it. I don't know if I care. But uh, yeah, I want to read this and I've wanted to read it anyway. But it's just kind of big and I haven't read a big book yet since I got back into reading. So we'll see. And lastly, I have Aristotle and Dante Discover the Secrets of the Universe by Benjamin Al Al Alres. And I still can't read his name. It looks like that. <laughs> someone help me out with this one too. Because someone helped me out with how to say Dietrich. Uh, for who wrote The Love Interest, and I would appreciate it if someone helped me with this one too. Uh, this is a book that apparently has like really good friendship and family and love, maybe? I don't really know what this is about, but everyone raves about it and I really want to read it. So yeah, that is my June Pride Month TBR. I know that the last two books I've read have also had queer main characters. It's kind of because that's what I want to read. Um, though Away We Go was an accident. I didn't know that the main character was gay when I went into it, and I was super surprised and excited about it. But uh, yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed this video, and I will see you when I do my next video. And at the end of the month, let's see which books I read. It's a surprise! Wee! Okay. <laughs> Bye.